so loud. Welcome to what the. <laughs> In this ward. Yo, you I know we're also gonna another item that we're gonna have to get is eucalypt. Yeah, the like. How about grappling hook, mirror, and stuff. Master mode. You wanna go into master mode right now? Yeah, let's go into master mode. I'm gonna make some rope coils real quick. First yeah, Terraria player uh, ever to craft rope coils. Uh, I don't know, but would you allow us to go into god mode to defeat? I mean, uh, yeah, it's it's journey mode. Sure, do it. Use it whatever you want. It's not like we're playing know. this for the challenge. We could do master mode bosses. Like, oh, we're also gonna, oh yeah, that, we're gonna have to catch every single type of bug. And I think the golden variants of all of them, we're gonna have to, like, get everything and all of the gold ones. No, I forgot to get, uh, the... Yeah, never trash anything. I'm gonna have to go against my own brain and not just trash everything. Like, uh, well, just random Evan, mushrooms trash... and flowers that I get. Evan, instead of trashing everything, you just go down and research them straight away. Yeah, I know, it's just, like, instinct. I get seeds and I'm like, oh, let me trash this. Without even thinking. Uh. How much money I have? Oh my god. I'm gonna have to make every single armor and every single weapon. Well, it's not that hard. It just means you have to build a building to uh. Hold them all. Well, not really. Yeah. Man. You don't need to hold them all. Like. Once you make one, but, once you move on, or once you make one, you just research it. But, still, one reason why I would play journey mode, one reason why journey mode is good, good is because, for me, playing journey mode... Well, yeah, I'm, will, I'm saying, like, you research it immediately, and you can make, like, a grand haul of all the armor later. Bro, I'm trying to... <laughs> Zombie took all my- took all me money! Oh, first- first statue has been made. Armor statue. I wish it was an easier way for me to sell a bunch of statues. Oh, for- for actual, like, bars, it's only 25. Yeah. Oh, and can of worms, it's- it's two! Oh my god, those maniacs! I'm gonna make a glorious house. You have fun, I'm gonna be here for like an hour. I'm building. And uh, farming uh, zombies. Uh, you have fun, I'm gonna be here for an hour. I don't need uh, The zombie hit me one time. Well, that gives I mean, me a gravestone to research. I mean, did you know the Dungeon Guardian only has 2,997 health? Hmm. I don't know, kinda. Ooh, the zombies are vanishing when I hit them. I've done like a thousand and a half damage. That's sick. Oh, you can also come over and do a lot more damage. Wait, you want to go into god mode first? Probably. Yeah, it'll really be cool. fine. <laughs> I have like seven, seven dungeon guardians on me. It'll be fine. <laughs> I'll just, just like I... I'll just move out of the way real quick. Evan. Near. Uh since I'm gonna be here for a couple of hours. I'm gonna be playing on the Xbox. Well I can quickly come help you if you're on red team. I've just gotta grab this chest since it's a new type of chest and well it's gonna be stuff inside of it, so. Yo, it's Kratover. Alright, I'm gonna teleport over. Yeah, I have six enemies. There's six dungeon guards. Evan, this is quite interesting looking, because I technically have two hands. Yeah, the big skeleton hand. Skeletron's just your dad. Oh, no, this is like, uh, the post dog dog. Yeah. Skeleton. Uh, Spider-Man. Yep. Cause I basically have two big arms. Arms to me right now. Well, he has many more. Oh boy, time to make every single number and letter statue. Oh, 
No, I can get you a better pickaxe. I'm, I'm, I don't really need one right now. I'm just mining. What do you, mean you don't need a better pickaxe. Well, I, it's I gonna mine gonna faster. Mine You're, what in what activity are you doing? Uh, mining. I'm pretty sure. I already have iron research. To... I'm gonna show you everything out of my own way. Actually, actually, it would be easier to go like this. Uh, can you place down a chest down here? Uh, somewhere downstairs, like under oh, somewhere. It the chest is only for me to dump everything I have in my inventory and give it to you. Yeah, now I can go deposit all, and you can research all of that. Oh, did you research tungsten? Do you have enough to do research tungsten? Yeah, I've researched tungsten. How do you think I gave you a pickaxe made of tungsten? Oh, I love a guide smoking a blunt texture pack. Uh, to get the mushroom dude, you have to have it above ground, correct? Uh, I think so. I believe it has to be above ground. Yo, just your arrows have been unlocked. Now instead of uh, normal arrows, I can have a full thing of gesture arrows. Am I hidden? Yeah. Uh, time for more me sitting, looking at the crafting thing, being like, huh. <laughs> oh my god, more stuff. Who could have seen this coming? Making a new crafting station leads to more things to craft. Although I do like the stuff that you make with the sawmill. I think it looks nice. It's a lot of decorative stuff. Except for the barrels. Those are not decorative. They are chests. <laughs> they are for real men. I sure that you need multiple of the stuff that you just craft. Because of some of the stuff that you craft. Because it's like... That doesn't make it any harder to get. That just means it takes longer to me for me to craft them all. Because I have infinite resources yeah i mean the one thing that uh we might have to do is uh we might need to move your house this house i don't wanna well i will unless you rebuild it for block for block i'm not letting you move it all right <laughs> unlocking mushroom items a lot of your activity is actually doing stuff while I'm just here crafting. I'm gonna have quite the compilation though. Don't go to the crimson. I didn't do anything to it. Nothing at all. Nothing happened. Well, me doing um nothing to the the crimson biome. Nothing at all may have gotten me some cactuses. How many dynamite did you sell? What? How much dynamite did you sell? Nothing. I didn't do. I didn't do anything. Don't worry. Don't you worry about the messages in chat. Nothing is happening. You could try and kill Brian to make sure you out of God mode first. I am out of god mode. What? Are you accusing me of cheating? I wouldn't stoop so low as to be at the same level of a dream. Well, if I wanted to actually beat Brain of Cthulhu, I could just use my, um... Doing nothing... Uh, thing to, um... Kill him... Quicker. Mm -hmm. And deal a lot of damage. But... I don't know how doing nothing would help me beat a boss, so... Oh, so you wanna... You wanna come up here and fight the Eye of Shtabubu? I don't know. But, uh, we can do, uh, Eye of... Eye of... Eye of... Eye Eye. Eye Eye, man. That's sick. That'll help out a lot in this boss battle.
I got teeth as my Christmas present this year. Okay, bye. We got this. I don't know about that. I hope I hope I do. Shoot him, man. Yeah! Okay. Charger bag opened. Shield of Cthulhu researched. Yeah. Yeah, I only got one. I got one, too. Oh, nice. Okay, treasure bag. Bam. Alright, let me grab some... What is this suspicious goon in So, oh, that's the pet. Yeah, put it on. I'm gonna go over to Brain. Also, uh, I think a good strategy for Brain is the grenades, since it's gonna kill all of the eyes. Now, this time when I approach, don't fucking place torches. Actually, like, you know, throw grenades instead. I was having a bit of trouble because, uh, you didn't know I kind of got rid of the ground. <laughs> so there wasn't much to stand on. Weird. Beating the boss legit. Legitimately, as long as you don't count the times that I uh, died and came back. Got him. No, wait. I think I just found a floating island. There's just water coming out of the sky. I'm gonna make a tower, but it also counts as a full booth. Floating island found. Ooh, balloon. In the dungeon, it's not like. Oh, it's because I turned off spawning. I was like, why am I just allowed in here? Yeah. Bye. Uh, bye. <laughs>